Several people have asked me to look into this Enrique Iglesias story, and now that I have, let me tell you, you're in for a wild ride. If you didn't already know this, Enrique and Anna Kornikova have been together for over 22 years, and they have three children. Well, there's a woman on social media named Maritza Herrera who has accused Enrique Iglesias of having an affair with her for years. She even made it very clear that Enrique Iglesias is very rich, she is a working middle class woman, and defamation of character is very illegal, so if she's lying, he could easily sue her. So of course when she said that, she had my full attention. She starts off by saying that every single song on the album Final that was released in 2021 is about her. In one of her captions, she says that she was having an affair with him for three years. I am the woman he wrote his last album about. However, the relationship has become toxic. He has been assaulting me, harassing, stalking, wiretapping me, and even leaked my identity to the dark web. He meets fans online to exploit them and use them as inspiration to create songs and millions of dollars. For proof, visit my Instagram profile, and she listed it below. So I go to her Instagram, and one of her posts shows her credit report and how she got an alert that her email was exposed to the dark web. She believes he did this because she proved that she was having an affair with him on Facebook Live. And so she reported him to the FBI for leaking her identity to the dark web, then mocking her and telling her, I'm a living legend and you're a stupid middle-class girl. No one will ever believe you over a legend. And not only does she say he was wiretapping her, but apparently wrote songs about it. And when she told the police, they didn't believe her. She also said that when she posted this video to try to expose him, his own father liked the post. Here's the thing, she got a friend request or a message request from an Enrique Iglesias. So she went to go message the real Enrique Iglesias asking if that was him, here's a photo, I got a message request from you. And she even has a post where she says she recorded them having phone you know what, as evidence. After going through everything she has posted, I think I know what's happening. She most certainly did not have an affair with Enrique Iglesias, but she 100% thinks she does, and I really do believe that's because somebody made a fake Enrique profile and convinced her he was the real Enrique. The reason I believe that is because I constantly get DMs from fake male celebs saying, thank you for supporting me. I had a Ryan Reynolds messaging me. It wasn't the real Ryan Reynolds. I really truly think she was taken advantage of and it really sucks because she truly believes Enrique Iglesias is like the biggest monster. No, I don't believe Enrique Iglesias is having affairs with fans online just to wiretap them and leak their email to the dark web just so he could write songs about it.